Here we go, Rifleman Cooper. Oh, hell. Ship must have power cycled the Simpod since last time. We'll have to recalibrate it. Running lifeboat diagnostic test 2.1. All Mark 8 lifeboats are in the green. Third militia grenadiers, prep dropship McAllen 17. Captain called the communications. We have to calibrate the pod, Rifleman. It won't boot up until you look at both of those lights. All personnel be advised. Operation Broadsword is a go. We are on final approach to Planet Typhon. Reminder to dock personnel. Titan Ordnance is a... We have to calibrate the pod, Rifleman. It won't boot up until you look at both of those lights. Running lifeboat diagnostic test 2.1. All Mark 8 lifeboats are in the green. Third Militia Grenadiers, prep dropship McAllen 17. Captain Cole to communications. Major Anderson, please report to the briefing room. All personnel be advised. Does that feel right to you, Cooper? Alright, we're good to go. Let's see how much you remember from last time. Setting the neural link. Not quite the same as a Titan link, but it's similar. To learn new skills, we need to be in the right state of mind. Ah, much better. Technically, I'm not supposed to be training you, but in you I see potential. Besides, we're at war. Who's got time for classes, eh? Here you go, up and over. Up the pace, enabling jump kit assist. Jump kits operate on the principle of relaxed stability. Once your jump kit calibrates to your movement style, enhanced mobility becomes second nature. Beautiful, isn't it? Inspired by my home planet of Harmony. This is where I grew up. This is what we're fighting for, Cooper. A world that's not metal and smoke. Show sure your jump kit is primed. Basic wall run here. Give it a try. Same routine as last time. Watch the ghost pilot and try to find Good. Now you're under here. Stay low. Simple double jump. Follow the ghost. We've retaken over a quarter of frontier space since the Battle of Demeter. Militia is better organized now. More people join every day. To play. See, people like you. used to just run and hide from them, but now we chase them. In combat, things never go as you expect. You must be ready to use any weapon you can find on the field. These are just a few of the weapons I've come across out there. Time to hit the range. Load your weapon. Use a different weapon this time. Grab another one off the rack. Gotta take them all out before we move on. Good. 
Practice more if you want, then head to the gauntlet. Practice as much as you can in this environment. Done there, we'll run the top. Next up is the gauntlet. Come on over with your enemy. Practice as much as you want, then meet me at the gauntlet. Run the gauntlet. Up is the gauntlet. Come on over when you're ready.
Practice as much as you want, then meet me at the gauntlet. Gauntlet. Come on over when you're ready. as much as you want, then meet me at the gauntlet. Up is the gauntlet. Come on over when you're ready.
new gauntlet for you to run today. Hard time is two minutes. Gotta do better than that to continue. Follow the ghost, or find your own path. Violets have to strike a balance in combat. Speed is paramount, but you must also hit the targets. The gauntlet is where we practice those skills, until the second nature. Remember, you move faster when you're wall running. Give it a try. Nice run. See the results board on the wall? You set a new best time. Everyone has different strengths and weaknesses, so be sure to run this a few times with different weapons. Look at the results board for more tips on how to improve. Now that you're warmed up, if you want a real challenge, you can race against other pilot ghosts. Word of warning though, the pilots who recorded these ghosts are the best in the SRS. If you can beat them, you'll be on your way to being a real pilot. Go ahead and run the gauntlet as much as you want. When you're done, I've got something special to show you. <laughs>